The uh, purpose of this tutorial is to show how this GeoGebra app works and um, it's all about graphing the equation of a line in slope slope well we normally call it slope y-intercept form or y equals mx plus b form and so here's the equation here this is how the app will always start and uh, you can change the line so for example if I uh, I drag the b down here so I made the line steeper uh, one of the important things here is the y-intercept so we might have to uh, drag it down a bit so you can see where it goes through the remember the vertical axis is the y-axis um, if you have a roller on your mouse you can always you can scroll in or scroll out like this to see more or less of the axis so you know you can move things around too so we change this around here. So, for example, um, this is uh, drawing a little rate triangle, uh, a rise run triangle, a slope triangle. So, the uh, the two and the four here. Remember, slope is rise over run. To go from B to A, I'm going up two. That's my two here, and I'm going across four. That's my run, and 1.5. That's the y-intercept right here. So, if I change this a little bit, uh, let's say to there. Uh, maybe even a little bit different. There we go. So there's my y intercept. It's five. Um, this is up four, across four. So they're both fours here. So um, that's that's how this this thing works here. One thing I do want to point out, and I'm going to use this line here. Uh, four over four is the same as 2 over 2 because they, they both divide out to 1. Notice this is exactly the same line. I'm still going through 5. See if I see that's the same line, that's the same line, that's the same line, okay? So because um, 5 over 5 or 4 over 4 or 2 over 2, that's all 1. That all reduces to 1, so it's the slope of 1 here. So that's how this uh, app works and uh, uh, you can just drag these around to make any kind of line whatsoever. You can't drag the y-intercept, you have to drag either the A or B points. And actually one thing to note, okay, so there's my 5 over, well actually, well let's, let's go, okay, there's my 3 over 3. If you reverse the order of these, then, okay, um, I've got them switched, that's why these change sign. Okay, so that's the only difference that makes. So, there's back to the same line again. So that's the only reason they change signs. If I actually check this box, it reverses the order from going from A to B or B to A. So that's the only thing that's doing. Uh, you can check this too and make the uh, slope as a, as a decimal. Um, especially you get into things like this, that's not particularly useful because it's nice to see what the, um, the fraction is. So I know I'm going up four and across three so I can see what the rise and run numbers are. So that's how the app works, and that's the end of the tutorial.